Now, Brenham ISD is making sure the transition from junior high to high school is a smooth one. That's right, Gabriella. Tonight was welcome to Pride Land event. Plenty of Brenham High Schoolers were on hand to introduce next year's freshmen to what it's like to be a Cub. Here's more. The move from junior high to high school can be a scary one. But at Brenham ISD, they're hoping they can get incoming freshmen prepared. So before they actually choose what classes and electives they want to take, we want to make sure they have all the information out there so they can choose exactly what they want to do. Welcome to Pride Land is an annual event that welcomes next year's ninth graders. The gyms and cafeteria were full of teachers and current students to introduce them to academic and extracurricular options at school. They need to see that students get involved in things. We want them to become involved as part of their high school career. Brenham High School is not short of clubs, organizations, and sports to be part of. These kids put in a lot of hard work, and it's something that they're really proud of. These, these things that they're um, involved in and dedicating and sacrificing their time for. This is the fifth year of Pride Land. Senior Katie Perkins was part of the first class of freshmen to go through the event. It was a huge deal. It was nothing we'd ever seen before, and I was, I was actually kind of scared to go. She remembers not knowing if she wanted to join band or do a sport. Getting to come here and getting to see all the clubs and really try to find a place that I was going to fit in, it was huge for me. Katie is now president of Brenham FFA. She enjoys being able to help new freshmen find where they belong. Last year was my first year. I was a freshman coming into Pride Land, and I met Katie, and Katie's been like my little guidance all the way up because she knows what it was like to be in their shoes once they get involved they just love it they want to do more they want to do as many activities as they can and if i can help them do that then that's really a win for me all right so next week counselors at brenham high will pay eighth graders a visit to go over and talk about their four-year career course outlook and that's what tonight was about to give them opportunities to look inside what they want to do for the next four years sounds fun yeah